Hello, everyone. Hello, everybody. Thank you all for joining us. I see Marielle, Zayamara. Welcome, guys. Nice. Thank you. Thank you for being here. We have an amazing training with the amazing Georgiana Haynes. And as always, <laughs> we're having too much fun, aren't we? <laughs> yeah. Always, always. <laughs> Why so I hope not? you guys are having a great start. We're, we're super excited because there's a lot of good sales that are happening. You know we love a sale. <laughs> Yes, we do. <laughs> Campaign 13 is here, everyone. It's, it's just started yesterday, and we can't wait to share our top picks. And our number one, which is <laughs> the vitamin C. <laughs> Milagros was telling me how much she loves this product. Let me just close some of this stuff. But Milagros was saying how much she loves this product. Now I was like, oh my gosh, I love this product too. <laughs> Mariel is here, Xiomara. How are you, Sharina? Thank you all for joining. If you have any questions about anything that we're sharing today, please let us know and feel free to share this video. Um, with your team, with um, a customer who might be looking for the vitamin C. And this is our top pick because I just, I had to do a double take <laughs> when I saw this because this is a great deal. First of all, the vitamin C is on sale from $44 to $24.99. Voila! <laughs> in and of itself is a really great deal because I use the vitamin C, I love it, and I try to catch it when it's on sale. And a lot of times it's just the serum that you'll get on a sale, but the fact that they threw in a freebie. Yes, this is a $27 value. And you know, this is uh, one of my favorite um, um, skin, um, I mean, this is the only scrub we have, but it, it's also very gentle on your skin. It's a warming scrub. Um, and once you apply it, you activate it with water. So this is, look how it's, it's very yellow. And you activate it with, with water and it starts getting warm which what that does, it opens up your pores and it makes them, um, it, it, it pulls the dirt out. So, you know, the effect that you get when you apply it is like a very bright, um, clean face, which I mean, it's like you took, um, um, you cleaned it for hours when in reality, this magnificent product um, does it all in a few minutes. So let us know what you think and um, we're gonna give you some ideas on how to promote this. And if you have ideas on how you are planning to promote it, we all, we would love to hear it from you um, because we're very open for ideas. We are not the experts and when we put our heads together, just everything becomes <laughs> <laughs> what you do you learn think? from each other. You learn yeah. from each other. And there's what I, I was sharing with my team um, in our Tuesday night meeting that the the great benefit of this company and the, this of this business is that we do work as a team. I don't know of any other company that really does teamwork like Avon does, which is what I love. And but it's up to us to take advantage of those opportunities. So I um, I subscribe to this concept of give, give, get. You know, the more you give, the more you get in return. So I'm always I love that we as representatives try to share with each other. You've always done amazing videos. There are a lot of reps out there who are always share and I've learned so much from everyone else and that's why I do videos to kind of just pay it forward but it was those people sharing with me that wanted me to, made me want to share with others but you know everybody looks at things differently the way I work in the big city is different from the way representatives work out of city thank you Marielle <laughs> we're gonna get to that I got you girl uh, <laughs> 
<laughs> but um, you know, you have ways of doing things that um, you know, other people may not have thought about, and and you may feel like, okay, you know, everybody knows that, but there are representatives who are new who watch this, or representatives who have been around for a while, but maybe they just haven't tried what you suggested. I learn all the time from listening to people, so um, you know. Don't be afraid to share in the comments. This is open, it's an open forum. Even though Milagros and I are on video, it's it's a conversation that's open to everyone. So share your vitamin C ideas. For me, I love the vitamin C. I have acne prone skin, so um, it leaves scars and I have hyperpigmentation as well. So I try, I love the brightening, all the brightening products. So I think this is also a great way to introduce to the customers um, the new vitamin C products that we have because we do have in campaign 13 the launch of let me see if i could turn to the page the um brightening eye cream as well as let me see what page it's on a face wash oh it, i was on that page <laughs> the priming moisturizer so you know if a customer hasn't tried the vitamin c yet she may be like okay well there's two new products no big deal but if you add them Melissa's is going to reach for them and show them to us if you you know, can introduce her to the serum and help her build the entire set. I know because I'm trying to brighten my skin and even my skin tone, I'm using the, the warming peel. I use the eye cream. There, there we go. Millie's got it all. So it's a, it's a, I love that Avon put the serum on sale with the free warming peel. And then you can share with your customers the eye cream. Millie's demonstrating for us. You can share the eye cream as well as the wash. So a person gets a full, well-rounded system. So um, I say it's a great offer to share with people. It's a, you know, you're getting the serum on sale, you're getting a free primer, um, plus, sorry, you're getting a free warming peel, and then you have the primer and the, the moisturizer, the eye moisturizing cream to go with it. So it's a really great opportunity to build a bundle, I think. And uh, Marielle is sharing a great idea. She's planning for a skincare class, Avon style. I love that, and I would love to be part of that. So I probably need an invitation, Marielle. <laughs> Send me invitations. <laughs> and hey, also, Susan, thanks for joining us. This is an illuminating primer. So the way, and okay, before I jump into this, from this to this, um, I like to share that the way that I um, use this is if you see sometimes some days I get dark circles and um, I like to especially on the uh, you know upper area of my eye this mm -hmm. this helps with the skin um, darkness it, it's just it helps to just brighten your entire skin uh, feel free to also apply this to your uh, lip area I like to mm. I like to do this throughout the day I mm. love to moisturize my lips because I think that we neglect this area a lot so I use a lot of my eye cream where, the, where the, the dryness occurs I always have dry skin or all around here and especially now with the masks that area needs that extra TLC yes I need grab mine so I can show you guys uh, up close. <laughs> <laughs> and while you're doing that, this is the um, the uh, illuminating priming. So the way that I like to um, use this is um, under your SPF. You using it during the day. Oh, you have yours. I wonder why I don't wear any on my calls. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. See, it looks so brightening. Anything. I swear, when I first used it, I was like, what is that, shimmer? <laughs> I can't, I can never like capture on camera. I was trying to take pictures to share, but there we go. Can you guys see that focus? Yes. yes There's I a little hint of shimmer. Oh, yes. So this is for your daytime, your daytime primer, and then yep. The oil is more for an evening treatment, even though, um, you know, when I'm home, when I'm not, <laughs> I love it. It feels so good, refreshing, so light. Uh, it absorbs 
very nicely, you guys. Yeah. Mm. See no oiliness, no oily yeah. residue. It's, yeah. I think it's great like for spring and summer because I feel like in, you may, okay, I love a matte look. I'm already oily <laughs> to begin with. I tend to have an oily T-zone. So I love like that cashmere complexion, the foundation and the concealer because it gives you that matte look. But sometimes you want to look matte, but not ashy, you know? So it's great yeah. to have a mattifying primer, mattifying concealer, but sometimes you still want to add in a little glow so that looks like skin, you know? I think that's a mistake that we make. We try so hard to mattify our skin that we end up looking, oh, look at the shine on Milagros' cheeks, yes. <laughs> I even look like I have makeup on and I don't have makeup yeah, on. Like under here, it looks like you put highlighter. Yes, it looks, it looks so good. Like, you know what I wanna do? I wanna apply this one on one side so you can see the difference when you apply the, uh, the oil. So um, that way you'll know the difference. So let me do this side. Turn to the light. Window. <laughs> <laughs> I did the wrong side. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm backwards here. <laughs> it's the, the camera is reversed, so you, your other right. <laughs> so see, look. I, 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 the serum was one of my favorite things when they first came out. There we go. Other way. But yeah. See, you yeah. Can tell the difference. Let me just, okay, so now that you see both sides, okay? So this one is a little shiny, and this one is a little dull. So I'm gonna apply it on this side, so you can see from this to this. And I have like super oily skin. I have, you know, and I do get pimples. I burned, <laughs> can you tell I'm cooking? She always says she gets pimples, and she has like a tiny, like a pinprick, and I'm like. That, I'm too old for pimples, okay? <laughs> so. I shouldn't even have one. <laughs> Sharina shares a good point. Sharina says she uses it on her elbows. And Sharina, that is a great idea. Where were you like a year ago when this stuff first came out? I actually just started using it on my elbows and knees. And um, I have a scar that I got Thanksgiving, last Thanksgiving. Yeah, last Thanksgiving from hot water that spilled in my lap. And I, somebody was, I was reading an article. Um, somebody referred me to an article. Um, just about vitamin C and I was reading it and they were saying that vitamin C is super great because it helps um, They call it a brightening serum, but it helps with scarring and one of the key things let me see if I can find the article I probably will not be able to but one of the key things it was saying was that um, Your scars, you know how your skin has different layers of the tissue They were saying that scars over the first three months move down into the you know, deeper and deeper layers, which makes it harder and harder for them to be removed. So by, you know, starting to use a vitamin C early on, like after you get a scar or a cut, it helps not only um, brighten your skin, but it helps the scar heal faster because it doesn't get that chance to move deeper into your skin layer. So um, as representatives, it's always great to, <laughs> Morelli said really too much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. She's showing you how to use the products, right? That's how, that's how I do in the mirror. But um, yeah, I, I think it's great for us as representatives to not only educate us ourselves on the specific products, but on the, the ingredients. Like why is Avon coming out with the vitamin C? Because it is like the holy grail of skincare. It does so much for your skin. It brightens, it lifts, it firms. It, it's so, it's just so good for your skin. Um, and it has it has the effect of thirty oranges. Okay, so look, I don't know if you can tell the difference when I um, but I think my skin looks a lot um, healthier. That's that's the word. I have no makeup on, which I don't know how good is that, but <laughs> but. Um, <laughs> It looks good, right? Tell me. Tell me. I love it. I've been using the vitamin C for a long time. It's one of my favorites. Like I keep saying, I cannot stress. And oh, here's the article. 
So um, I don't know who said this. Jessica Wu, who is a a beauty. You're such a reader. <laughs> I was reading this morning when Milagros and I were talking, and. <laughs> Looking my face, and she was like, "I see you." <laughs> and I was like, "Sorry, I'm reading." But so yeah, so brighteners, skin brighteners like vitamin C within six months. So correction, not three months, six months. When within six months of seeing a dark spot, um, you want to use your vitamin C treatments because mel melanin, the darkness, goes deeper into skin over time, so it gets harder to reach. So when you get that melanin you know, whether it's dark spot, a scar, a sunspot on that top layer, you basically have six months before it's, it goes deeper and gets harder to reach. So you wanna get it while it's still at the top layer and the vitamin C serums do that. So you have a serum you can use at night, even though I use it in the day too. Uh, <laughs> you have your, your primer now that you can use. You have your warming peel for targeted treatment and now the brightening eye cream. Yes, I love them. Uh, my, my skin feels like it's, it's getting tighter and um, I feel I actually feel like a little tingling also maybe because I I mean not a, not like a hard tingling but you know when I feel like tingling that means that the product is working but maybe because I just added layers on layers <laughs> well that massaging in or you could still have the warming peel on your fingers you yeah still have the warming peel on your hands? Probably, yeah, that's true too. Shireen, <laughs> <laughs> it says that her mom recently burned her hand, and it's really been helping to soothe. Oh, thank you, that's awesome. And maybe I need to add it to my burn. I was, I burned while I was baking. I'm not a baker. Mm -hmm. Should have known. <laughs> I'm going to add some of it. Thank you for the tip. So, yeah. yeah. When I, I read the article, I was like, okay, all the scars, they're getting vitamin C. The elbows, like Sharina said. Oh, Miss Alice, thanks for joining us. Hi, so, Alice. Yeah. <laughs> vitamin C is a great intro product for customers, and there's no age group for it. So, you know, regardless of how old or how young people are, it's a great product for, you know, across the age ranges. I know that like a new product, we used to say, okay, well, are you 25 to 30, 30 to 40, 40, 50? What is it skin? Is your skin sagging? Whatever. Vitamin C is something that anybody can use and they can add it straight into the regimen. I, um, I'll use my vitamin C serum at night. Um, if I am layering, the serum is light. It's very lightweight. So remember that your serums go in, see, super light. Your serums go in order from light to heavy. So for example, the vitamin C would go on before the green goddess. Green goddess is a heavier oil. So that would go on um, after. And then if you're using a night cream, then that would be the last thing because usually creams are heavier. So a cream like Mission, which is super thick. See if you guys can see that, probably not. It's a very, very thick cream. That of course goes on last. So, you know, help your customers in, introduce vitamin C into their existing regimen. I know we talk, we, we have a lot of different regimens with Avon, but it doesn't mean that you have to give up one over the other. It just means that each one can target a different thing. So you just incorporate it. Great tips. I love, I love, love, love your tips. I actually learned something because I, I use both the Green Goddess and, and the uh, vitamin C. So... They're both one of my two favorite oils. And the doctor, the Dr. Belmer. Have you yes. I mean, I off the subject with this one? But we're talking about oil, so why not? This is pairs really well, not just because we're talking about oils and serums, but if you know, if you're looking, if you have a customer like me who has wants to brighten, that is a great product too, because it heals. Yes. <laughs> And it's so, <laughs> it's so light. It's just like what it, it looks like, like water. You know, it's very absorbing. So this, this could be something for for um, you know, a younger, young, younger skin. Um, a, a, an oil that I would uh, use in the mornings uh, rather than the thicker oils. 
Um, it really, I really love it. Love, love, love. And so for those of you who are representatives who are watching, Malagra said that that is super light and it feels like water. So if you're using that, the the C cup with the vitamin C and the green goddess, which one, let us show us in the comments box that you've been listening, that you know your stuff, which one would go on first? A little Q and A to liven things up for you guys. Mm, I love that. <laughs> so yes, I would, um, I will use the lighter. What do you think? You're not giving me the answer yet. The lighter. Somebody give us, yeah, give us the answer. You guys know this. <laughs> we just talked about it, so I'm not throwing you a curveball. <laughs> we want to hear in the comments you. Below, which one you think would go on first? Uh, Alice, what's the name, Alice? What's the name? <laughs> Let me see some names. Give us the product name. You guys know it. You've seen it in the brochure. I know it's been in my medicine cabinet for the last Seek up couple of months. I'm on my <laughs> yes, this is the one Alice says. First this one, and then which one? The second one, the vitamin C, the B, <laughs> the lightest, so you can lay your <laughs> It's not multiple choice, Sharina. <laughs> A, B, and C, right? <laughs> okay. Next multiple next next quiz that we do, we'll do multiple choice. <laughs> A, B, so and C. C, 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 A. <laughs> you guys A. are too much. <laughs> um, B. Is it B? No, it's um. I think vitamin C should just default B C because it's easier to remember. There's a big C on it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's great, you guys. See, we just had, Yeah, we had a little fun here. <laughs> so uh, let me tell you something that I have been doing since we have been dealing with this pandemic thing. So I'm going to give you some ideas of what I have been doing. Before everything started, I had ordered a whole bunch of books, over a hundred books I order every campaign. So I had um, most of the books left over. So what I'm doing, and I'm planning to share the, the pictures, I um, um, I have different ideas of what I want to do. First, I want to drop off a book in the front of my customers who used to order face-to-face -face so they can see that I'm not gone into another world. With the other, because I don't have 100 customers, with the leftover books, and I'm planning to do those with just my local customers so they can come and pick up the orders here or order online. So with my leftover books, I'm planning to do a book toss um, around my neighborhood so that they, um, you know, that they know that they can order either online or face to face. I'm planning to do a post a note, you know, just a simple note uh, that says, hi, I'm, I'm a local Avon representative. I drop, I'm dropping off this book because we're, um, not doing the face-to-face, -face, feel free to order online. Um, it's very user-friendly. And if you have any questions about your products and, and, and your order, please contact me at this number. So what do you think, you guys? Anyone has leftover books? Look, mine are over there. And they're not the side. All of us do, because this whole thing just kind of- Hard time. Just, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> Those are my books that I plan to just put into bags and give it to my customers and build some more customers online. So that's an idea that you can do if you have leftover books and throw them away, let them go online, put a little note, and keep um, increasing your sales. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I, I think that's a great idea. And I've been hearing a lot of reps and some of you I've spoken to recently are on the call, not call, on the live stream <laughs> right now have been sharing stuff. So if you've, you know, if you've been keeping your business active, share with us in the comments some of the things that you're doing. You might spark an idea for another representative. Um, 
thank you for sharing with us, Milan Girls. That's a great idea. Um, and I would also like to say that you can also remember, remind your customers, maybe those have, who have been shopping with you for a while, but who haven't registered online, we do have the promo tool. Um, let me see if I could just click over real quick and show you guys. Nope, there we go. Yes. Uh, <laughs> so when you guys are on avonnow.com, I usually just like to click Avon Now and start from the home page. I'm gonna just make it a little bigger so you can see all the tabs at the top. Up here under Manage Business, you do have a section for promo tools. So you can send different promos to your customer. I'm gonna see, hopefully it doesn't show my customer names, but um, when you open the promo tool, you can find different offers that you could send to your customer. So in the way that Milagros is sharing a post-it note, if you're not sure what to write on the post-it note, you can let them know that you give a special offer to your customers. And this is what I've been doing for my customers. Each promo tool is specific for the customers that you send them, that you send it to. So these are some promos that I have going on now. But when you create a new promotion, only the customers that you've emailed that are on your email list, first and foremost. So you have to start getting your customers in your database. So only your customers that are on your email list and only the customers that you have emailed that specific promotion to um, can use the code, the promo code that you've given them. So I've been um, asking my customers to visit my website and register as a customer so that they can get the promo tools and they have to subscribe to um, receive offers from you. Um, I had a customer, unfortunately, the other day, she had, she is registered, but for some reason, Avon's not picking it up, so we're going to sort it out, but um, you have to just make sure that they register to receive your emails, and then you could send them different promotions. Um, you can send them free shipping on a $50 order, or 10% on, off on their $50 order. I've been sharing the 10% off with my, with my new customers, so um, I let them know that when they subscribe, I'm going to send them an email with the offer code. And you know, a lot of other companies do this. So I think it's great that we now have that option to share that with our customers as well. So as you're tossing your brochures or um, getting out your getting promotions out to your customers, be it on social media or, or not face to face anymore, but within your area, um, you can use those promos to share with your customers. Would you share that a little slower, Georgiana. Yes. I love that. That is so. So, where do they go first to create right. promotions? I'm going to make it bigger so that you can see. So, from avonnow.com, you see all these tabs at the top. Under the manage business tab, there's a tab that says promotion Perfect. tool. Yes. So, there you have it. It's so. And that's what you find. You know, I have to be honest with you, I haven't done any of my promotions, but I do have one of my customers who um, goes to work and she said that um, she likes the um, reversal list, the SPF lotion, uh, SPF mm -hmm. 25 uh, lotion. And, um, and then she said that a few of her coworkers want, want to order. So I was thinking about creating a, her 10% code. Look at that. And do they have, what is it that I see in the bottom? 20%? Is it a 20%? Oh, those were the codes that I created. So um, let me show you the different promotions they have. Avon does curate the codes. You can't send any and anything that you, you want. I think maybe not yet. Maybe they'll introduce that later on. But for now, they've kind of set up the different promos that we have. I'm sorry, it's loading slowly because I'm streaming. <laughs> but um, if I could bring up the list for you. So you have free shipping with a $50 order, a free Cucina hand soap sample. So um, that's a great new product we have that you can share. You have 10% off your $50 order, and then you have a free Veilment natural black rose shower gel sample. So um, wow. two samples free shipping or 10% off. And what I've been seeing is these two samples just kind of opened up this week. Can before you show, it was the the Can you show so it? Then you show the promotions in the screen. The, oh, the, my, the, the promotions, when you click them, it kind of just comes up over here oh, and then you would okay. create. A, so okay. the codes that you saw at the bottom of the screen before are codes that I just made up. So um, you can, what I like about this is that you could customize the code. So you can say like, Georgie's birthday. And you could send that to your customer. Like this is a specific code for you on your birthday that you can have. 
So you can oh, have fun with it. Love that. Look at that. Yes. Wow. Well, thank you for sharing. And that gives me a head start to start doing my own promotions. What do you think, everyone? Who's the customer that you have? You can customize it and send something just for her and make her feel special. You know, thank her for sharing your brochure at her job. Yes. Good, good tips. Um, I, I want to share now <laughs> the calendar, the, um, the calendar for the upcoming trainings and where to find them. So I could swap <laughs> this one. Good. Oh, this the Lagros is sharing. Yes. So can we get some applause from Milagros who's oh. working on her? We're all learning and growing here, but Millie's sharing. <laughs> Thank you. See, I'm learning as I go too. This is all this is new. So no one can say that they can't do this because I have been learning from you as I go. <laughs> so thank you. Um, and I want to share the, the trainings that, that we have. Like, for example, let's take today. Today is Thursday at 2 p.m. We have um, a Facebook Live, okay, on Avon Representatives USA website. Then we have the, uh, the same, the same um, training in Spanish at 3. Then we're talking about the new bombs um, and in Spanish, in, in English at 4 and Spanish at 6. But there's one training that I would like for all of you, even if you are not a new representative, I would love for you to register to the new, uh, to the representative, um, new representative orientation webinar so that you can have an idea of what it's covered there. I personally registered to this one. That way I can talk about it and, and, and invite my team uh, for the next ones. But I'm also encouraging my team members to all of them to go to this, this calendar and share, um, I mean, and register for this webinar. So on next Tuesday, is, if you can see here at 8 p.m. is in English. And then the same webinar on Wednesday at 8 p.m. So every, um, you know, every month you have uh, a series of trainings and Facebook lives that you're able to take. And um, don't forget that this is a tool that you can share with your representatives, with your team, um, something that you can take advantage of because in these live videos, they give you a lot of um, you know, not, not recognition. They, they do drawings for participating and, and it just builds the excitement of, you know, wanting to be there. And there's something about, um, having your name mentioned, you know, <laughs> say, hi, Georgiana, thank you for joining. <laughs> so, yes. Yeah, I took the new rep training last week. Um, not last week, yeah, last week. Um, just, I mean, I've been a rep for years, but I think it's always good to refresh yourself. And what I liked about the the new training is that it's it's what's happening now. So it, the tips and ideas that they're sharing are not just the way that we've always done things, but ways that you could do things now in this current environment that we're in, you know, how to share your brochures on, or how to share your business on social, how to stay in touch with customers, even when you can't physically see them. So they're also sharing a lot of tips on, on those things. So it's really great to, to take, especially if um, you're struggling, like all of we, all of us are to get a grasp on how we can work our business during this time. Yes, thank you so much. Uh, working from home, it's all about working from home and staying safe and, um, you know, and, and protecting the people around you. Um, I, I was thinking the other day that things are not going to be the same um, as they used to before, especially for a lot of places. 
So I think we need to reinvent a lot of what we're doing and learn a few things um, on on internet now that we're home and make the best of it and educate our customers and our team to not stop the business, to keep going and, 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 and try new things. Yeah, I think that's key at this point in time. It's sort of like, think about all the revolutions that we have. I always like to look at history. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember historical dates and names and stuff, but I always say we learn from our past. So if you look back at the Industrial Revolution, for example, I think that was probably the most recent one that most people are familiar with. I mean, in the past, you used to do everything manually. There were no machines. So the idea that there would be machines helping us you know, at that time was so drawing. And there were a lot of people who resisted, but when they kind of just accepted it for what it was, we were able to move forward. So I feel like we're in that a time right now where we're, I feel like the computer revolution technically already happened, but I feel like now everybody is, we're at that moment where we all just have to embrace it for what it is. And it's funny you say that because I was talking to a customer the other day that I have. Um, she lives out of state, but you, you know, we, we she still shops you know, um, and she had a relative who was placing the orders for her, but she was like, you know, I, I've been resisting all of this um, technology stuff. I don't have Wi-Fi. I own a computer, but it's not connected. I didn't know how to use it. And now, you know, she always went to the bank and talked to the teller and went to the post office and spoke to the teller. And now it's machines. Like everywhere she goes, she cannot, it, it, she can speak to the teller, but that means that she has to stand on this super long line. She can go to the machine and kind of get through a little bit faster. For her, it's, it's a transition because she, she's learning how to use all of these machines at once. And I always share with my team, you know, when it's better to do transitions gradually because like computers didn't just get introduced today. Online shopping didn't just get introduced during COVID. We've been doing this for a long time. So it's really important, you know, as the systems and companies and business and life changes around you gradually, it really helps you to make those changes gradually as well so that you're not just forced into this, you know, big transition when it happens. So I always share with my team, if you see Avon rolling out changes, if you see, I, I like to read to see what's happening in the environment around me. If you start to see changes happening and around you, our, I think our human nature just wants us to ignore it because it can be overwhelming and block it out and just stick to the way that we're doing things for all our lives because it's easier, but it's always better to kind of just open the, the crack a little bit to kind of let some of that new stuff in little by little, because it's better for you to learn gradually than to just have this big change overnight. So um, with speaking to her, she's making the leap because she's like, she doesn't want to stand in the line. So she's learning how to use the computers and I applaud her, I cheer her on. I know she's not on Facebook, <laughs> she's not quite there yet. Um, so she doesn't. she's not gonna hear this, but uh, you know, it's just better to, make that gradual change. I'm trying to explain that to family members as well who resisted the smartphone and didn't want to learn it, didn't want to learn the computer. And now they have to place orders for groceries and stuff online. So make the transition slow. Yes, exactly. I I love that. And, and you know, everything is practice. And like you shared um, a few uh, videos back that you know, clicking on links and things on your avonnow.com is not going to break the screen <laughs> or the program. <laughs> click everything. Click everything. I love that. Just click. Click, 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 click. <laughs> you never know, like, you never know what you'll figure out. You never know what you find. And it's, I, if this is an old school reference, so it's kind of like contradictory to what I'm saying, but I have my old boss believe very strongly in physical books. I love a book, I love to turn pages, I have nothing against books, but um, he always had dictionaries. So he would go into the dictionary if he needed to find a word or how to spell a word, definition of a word, or if you wanted the source to say things differently, you would always go to the physical book. And I was like, dude, why don't you just Google it? Like, <laughs> just put in search and he said, no. He goes to the dictionary because whenever he's, when you're in the dictionary, I'll, I'll just use my planner as an example. When you're in there, you get in, you go to the section you want, you kind of turn, you know, when you're looking for it, you turn pages. So he's like subconsciously, your mind sees different things in the book. And then later on, you may not, you may not know that you, you're going to need it, but 
later on, you might remember that you saw this thing in the past and you'd be able to go back to it. It's like that with like online click stuff. You may not need it right now, but it might give you an idea that later on when you need it, you could say, oh yeah, I saw something like that in such and such a place. Let me go back there and see if I could kind of figure my way out from there. So it's the same thing with online. It's just like a book, the way you turn the pages, just click stuff. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes, that makes a lot of sense. So, and now we want to talk about the free to join and Georgiana, tell everyone what it's in it for new representatives who come in during Camping 13. I wish I had photos for you guys. Dear Avon, get some pictures of stuff so that we could tell you. But with Camping 13, I'm excited about this. And whether you're an existing rep who is referring people into the company or you're brand new this is for everyone so if you're listening and you're like okay i'm already a rep this isn't for me this is now a great time to refer people into the company to start building your team to start taking advantage of the leadership bonuses and commissions that come from building your team because what avon is doing is they are offering um brand new products to their customers so we have a brand new we have, you know, we've been having new products, the belief, um, properly, and things coming in from different companies. And Avon is now starting to roll up. So, um, what they're doing with new representatives is starting now in campaign 13, they're going to be giving a complimentary sample pack. Um, the samples are going to vary. So, I think that's why me and Millie were talking about it earlier. We maybe don't have pictures because there's no specific package that's going out to different representatives. Um, but the representatives are going to start to get some samples. It's going to be belief. VDL. I know we have some new Propley samples that just came out. Those might be in there. But every representative is going to get um, a sample pack when they place a $60 order. So you don't just join and get freebies. When you join and place a $60 order, then you get a free sample pack. Plus, A1 is giving a $10 credit for their next campaign on Avon now. So I love this because I feel like it's starting to build momentum. We have, mm -hmm. you know, it's not just about like open the account and sit there and do nothing. This is a business. We're here to make money or we're here to get a discount on our products. So you want to take advantage of that stuff while you have it. So they're encouraging representatives to place their orders early on. And studies have shown, Avon studies, that when a representative gets in and places a first order, they're more likely to be successful than if they get in, sit for a while and don't do anything. And you know, the more times that pass with them not doing anything, the likelihood for their success decreases. So you wanna get them in, get them motivated, energized, get the orders going because you know, we're, we're just talking about learning new things. When you've got an order, you go into your Avon.com, you're looking for your customers, you're clicking stuff because you're, you're figuring the business out. You're working actively on building your business. So I think that these freebies, the samples and the $10 credit starting now in campaign 13, when you representative place a $60 order, <laughs> all that, you know, fine print, all of this is, is a great opportunity to encourage new reps, not just to place that first order, but to, in the long run, have a better likelihood of having a more successful business. And um, for the new ones also, you have eight campaigns to cash in on um, $20 for every $200 in your campaign, plus cumulative. <laughs> 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 you get an additional a hundred dollars so um, all of this accumulates for a total of a 65 percent earnings on a five thousand dollar order within those eight campaigns you can only do this during your first eight campaigns and also there's uh, advancing title bonuses, there's mentoring bonuses when you duplicate your leadership. So get excited about the earnings, you know, share. Yes, we want to see you succeed. <laughs> yeah, and I'm seeing it in the stuff that's rolling out. Like all of these freebies, you get, you join, you get some free samples. Those are things that you can use to help you find customers, but also for yourself to experience the product. We're big on this show. 
<laughs> show. But we're, we're big here, Millie and I, on you know sampling and using the products. You can see all the products we're sharing are stuff that we use ourselves. Um, we'll get to hair in a minute. But <laughs> you're you're getting ten dollars back to use on you know as a discount on your order, or it's basically extra earnings. So you're getting ten dollars. Um, but you have to place another order to qualify for that ten dollars. Like Milagro said, with those um, new representative bonuses, you get twenty dollars back basically on every hundred dollars. So it's like incrementally helping new representatives start to see more earnings. When you place that five, when you get your five thousand dollars that um, in sales that Avon mentioned, that Milagros mentioned, at sixty five percent earnings, you're earning more than the highest sales level within Avon as a new representative because they want to give you a taste of what I call the sweet life. You're also going to be a premier um, premier President's Club level, President's Recognition Program member level. So that premier level, when you sell $5,000 or more, it also bumps up your earnings on all of your orders. So instead of earning the 20, well, zero to, I don't know, 20 on a, a $40 order, you'll get 25. Uh, higher, 25%. Yes. Okay. So instead of getting between zero and 25, you get a higher earnings percentage. And that kind of introduces you. It's like the doormat to get your foot in the door for President's Club, which is where you get a set 40% earnings. So they're trying to work you up to earning more, putting more money in your pocket. And that's what we want to do here, you know? Yes. Uh, tell us about your beautiful hair because. Marielle gave you a compliment and I was muted and I couldn't say, yeah, I told her that too. I told her that too. <laughs> Thank you again, Marielle. Yeah, I want to share the products that I've been using. I'm going to just switch screens for a second here because we have some great stuff. Um, again, brand new products that Avon is coming out with that we've that I've been testing and sharing. There we go. So you guys know I, I love Chi. I've loved it for a long time. Millie also sings the praises of Chi. Um, so with the Chi hair care line, we've also come out with a lot of different hair care products. And again, in the same way that we talk about your serums for your, I think I'm going in the wrong direction here, but your serums for your face, here we go. You can also mix and match your hair care. So I've actually been using a combination of different hair care and I've been seeing a huge difference in like the dryness of my hair getting improved and my curls, the elasticity of my hair. And the latest product I added is this, let me bring back the screen, brand new Bio Silk, Silk Therapy. Um, I've been trying it. I've tried it, I think three times so far, but it's a brand new product and it's a weightless leave-in silk treatment. So this has like silk fibers that help strengthen your hair. And I wanted to talk about it because I feel like you use it a little bit differently than you would normally use some of the other hair care products. So the Chi Care is like a serum. You put it on, I put it in my hair is still wet, um, but you can also use it dry, but I like to use it when it's wet because I feel like it absorbs more. And then I actually followed up with another hair serum. So I do use two serums in my hair. This is the Propylee Thera. You guys can see I've been drinking it, but <laughs> This is the Propylee Thera Hair Oil Treatment. This is a little bit heavier than the, the Chi Serum. So it's a, it's not as heavy. You can see it's still liquid. It's not, it features beeswax. And I think a lot of people got scared when they heard wax because, you know, you normally think of candle wax, but it's not like that at all. It's actually very thin. And then I follow it up with the um, Silk Therapy. So this guy is not really a... A serum in the sense of it's not like chi and I have other stuff on my hand but it's not like me or probably Thera it is the the texture I think let me see if I can see this of a serum but it's a little bit heavier and the way that I like to use this guy is just to seal my hair at the end so after I've applied all my other products I just put very little of this in my hair now I am that person who even when I use the Chi, they tell you, like Propylee Thera, they tell you to use two pumps in your entire head. Yeah, one to two pumps evenly on damp or dry hair. I use like four pumps. So I use <laughs> everything, I'm a lot of too. So I use the serums, I use a lot more of the serums, but I think with the, um, the Silk Therapy, a little bit really does go a long way. It's not a moisturizer, it's not a, um, damage it, it is a damage repair treatment but you don't want to use it in the way that you would 
the serum you're coating your entire hair with like a heavy layer of it. You kind of just want to put a light layer and I really kind of just get it in my ends in the parts of my hair that are kind of frizzy. I kind of just squeeze it in, scrunch it in, rub it through. And I find that this also works very well when your hair is wet. If you're curly and natural like me, it works well when your hair is wet, but you can also use it when your hair is dry. So that's what I've been using and I've been seeing the improvement in my ends. My ends are always just so super dry. I don't know if you guys can even I can see. see it. I mean, yeah. I definitely. You look like you look like you took off uh, 10, 10 years at least. I was like, you look like such a little girl. <laughs> Her and Alba were, were telling me like I look younger when my hair is out, but yes. I've also like other people have been asking me if I dyed my hair because it looks darker, but I think it's not so much. You said that this morning too, but I haven't dyed it. I haven't changed it. I think it's just when it's dry, it gets like it lacks the luster, so it looks lighter. So now that it's getting more hydrated and moisturized, it's giving me like a more a richer, darker look. And this stuff smells so good. Like yeah. it's so 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 good, and it stays. The smell stays. I, I used it the other day and then I was like, hmm, still smells. <laughs> and my hair too, I wanted to share that my hair is so puffy. Look, I have, like, I had like really poor hair, like really thin and like, like a doll. But the other day after I took a shower and I let it dry when I was brushing it, my hair is longer, it's more puffy. I have keratin. I have keratin in my hair, and my keratin usually lasts a whole year. So I did it in January, and look, my hair is so curly. Like when I wash it, it goes like, Ch. so it's longer. So that means it's healthy, you know. It. Yes. So I love it. I love, love, love. I haven't gone to get my hair done. Um, used, um, I do color. So I have a new, um, a new um, hair coloring coming in this campaign. I'm, I'm, I'm using two. I'm actually using two colors. Um, and one is, I always forget, but if you put it on the screen, maybe I yeah, can. Let me bring it up. Faster. So this is a great see. tip part for all of you. Can, Can you see the color? Here. Yeah. So uh, we're doing the um, um, this one the, with the naturals, the last one. I'm doing the last one. Yes. And then with the warms, I'm doing the last one. Um, and I'm mixing those two because um, I have highlights. So with the highlights, my hair looks, um, you know, lighter. So I don't want to darken my hair because then I have to start all over again with my highlights. <laughs> so I'm doing my grace with the, um, the naturals and then I am mixing, this is something new that I'm trying, I'm mixing uh, the, the naturals and the warms together so that I can do the rest of my hair. So that's a tip. I don't know if you guys. Uh, Let us see how that turns out. Yes. And this I've actually used they, the, the, the hair care, the hair um, color, it lasts over a month because I haven't color my hair look see i have like my roots coming out i has i do have some grays but um yeah most of my grays come from here and here and i haven't done it in over a month so it does last you guys great quality it does not damage your hair i totally recommend it so and your hair looks amazing Thank you. It's getting there. It's like a work in progress, but I've been learning that in the same way with your skin, sometimes you don't realize how what kind of problem you have until you start to use a product and you're like, it looks so much better now. <laughs> so that's why, like, again, like with the computer, try stuff. You may not feel like with the BioSilk 
therapy, I said, okay, I'm already using a damage repair treatment. I don't think I need another one. I'm actually using two serums already. Why do I need another one? But I have been finding that I like this guy and it does work well with the others. So I feel like our hair care is kind of moving in the direction of our skincare where you can use a variety of different targeted treatments to work on whatever issues you have or if issues that you don't even know that you have until you try a product. But I think it's great to, to try new things. You know, you never know what the result is gonna be. And I've tried products that I figured weren't really for me, but I can refer it to a friend. So like Milagros was saying that she loves the chi more than this guy. So for her, you know, her, her experience is different. We don't have the same kind of hair. <laughs> We're not the same age. We don't live in the same um, climate. So it's always good to try different products so that you can share your experience with yes. Um, customers. Yes, and, and my husband is using it too. He used to be a, um, one that would put a lot of gel in, in his hair. <laughs> And when you guys see me in a ponytail when it slipped back, it's gel. It's a oh lot of gel. Oh my gosh. He used to, like, like you, could, you could see like his whole hair like packed. <laughs> so now he tells me, okay, uh, put some of the chi with the spray. So I, I put the chi, that oil, and then I lock in with the spray. And it's, it stays the entire day, the next day. Yes, yeah, so like slick. <laughs> Go through that again. So you put instead of gel. Instead of gel, I use the the chi serum, and mm -hmm. then so he washes his hair. He towel dries his hair really good. Then I I get that the chi serum, and then I lock it in with the spray, the chi spray. And I'm telling you, like his his hair is is little wavy. And, um, you know, he has wavy hair, but also he got stick hairs that stick out. Like, so, <laughs> so you see like little hairs. Like, <laughs> so when you put that on, it's like, ooh, you don't need to do anything. And he's getting so healthy. He's even letting it grow. So you know that Carlos has like really tight fade. He's growing his hair. Yes, yes. So use it on your guys, you know? They're gonna appreciate that little uh, therapy. <laughs> and like, <laughs> when Sharina says it brightens her silvers too. So great idea, I love that. I think that the hair care products have been um, becoming more popular. People have been asking about them more because the barbershops and the salons are closed. So we were taking more time on our own hair and you know, trying to figure out what we could do ourselves to create healthier hair. And I think it's great because you're realizing that there is, you do have more power over your own hair. So, you know, as opposed to relying on someone else. So I think that like with the guys, they can't go to the barbershop. So they've been, you know, growing their hair out, but also making sure that it grows out healthier and kind of taking more time to, to care for their hair. So it, it's not just like, oh, I'm going to cut it off. What does it matter anyway? They're, you know, treating it and making it healthy. And let me tell you that um, the serum, the Chi serum, I've also been recommending it to the guys with beards because, you know, sometimes the guys want to have like, you know, shiny, healthy beards, especially those who grow it out. So that, that cheese serum is also quite nice for the guys with the beard. I love it. I'm this too, because this can be used on skin. So I need to find a guy who's willing to <laughs> let me experiment with his beard. <laughs> You know, I think that I love the silk, but um, it's it's just it's just too light for my for my hair. I think that the silk is more for people who have um, oily um, oily hair, and, and I I use the propoli, the oil. I use it to retouch. Like I would use the chi and the spray, but then I use the propoli to retouch my ends because it's a lot more hydrating than than the uh, the chi. Yeah, I, I also find that, like for me, I can use the chi and, sorry, I did this side of my hair and I didn't do this side, so I'm like, let me even it out. <laughs> I feel like the um, I can use the chi alone in the summer, but this past winter I did find that I was 
my hair kind of wanted a little bit of something else. So I found, that's how I ended up using the propylene there because I felt like I needed a little, you know, in the winter your hair is drier, you have the hats and the scarves and the heat is on. So you, you feel like you need something else to kind of keep um, the moisture in. And that's how I got to use the propylene. I think the silk therapy is probably one of those things that maybe takes a little bit longer for you to see results because mm -hmm. um, they, they said that it repairs your hair like on the inside. So it's some, mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna try it some more and see. Very nice. And um, Sharina <laughs> says that she received many compliments since her entire hair is now gray. Yes, if you know, it's embrace, embrace your grays. <laughs> Gray is really popular now. It's like you know, Della Reese brought it in that gray, elegant gray streak, and now that um, what is his name? There's a a male actor. I always feel like guys are more accepting of their grays than women, but I feel like we should embrace the grays. I'm trying to fix now what I've messed up. <laughs> I feel like the ladies, we we look no, really look good. I like it. Yes strange things but i feel like ladies should embrace the grays as well and i love that the chi gray I, I have a couple of um people that i know who have been using it who are gray i feel like it like sharina says it gives your grays like a radiance mm -hmm. so it's not i feel like dull gray is like oh, okay but when it's like gray and silvery when it's a silvery gray it looks really nice yes and and it's some people just gray evenly you know they you know once they get gray they just get gray evenly and it's it's just great to be natural so i'll get there someday this <laughs> <laughs> alice says she's gonna try some of the hair products she mainly uses the shampoos and the conditioner okay so if you like like the advanced techniques alice if you've been using the advanced techniques because i was definitely in that camp I think you're, you're really going to be surprised at these new products. First of all, you use less. I've noticed that I use less shampoo and conditioner from the Chi line than I did from any other hairline. Like the glob that you put in your hand is going to be smaller. So you're, you're, you get more bang for your buck. Um, and the results, you do see the results. You're going to start to see results in the first wash. Miss Alice, go for it. Yes. I also recommend to interchange them. Like, um, you know, one week you use the propoli, Thera, and then another week um, use the chi, and then you can also, um, you know, use both because at the end of my shampoo, <laughs> I, I do the chi and I also do the propoli, Thera, and I leave it in. And I get both benefits. Um, the um, I think that for me, the Propoli Thera uh, dries out my hair, removes the oils uh, too much. But if I want like a cleaner uh, look, if I if I want to really blow dry my hair, then I go for the Propoli Thera, and then I use at the end the Chi and mix them both. But if you want like if you're not dry, blow drying your hair and if you just you know, letting it dry naturally and put it in a ponytail like I am right now, then I recommend not to remove that much oil uh, from your hair mm -hmm. and let it just, you know, become um, less <sighs> and natural. <laughs> That's an interesting point you bring up. I was reading, again, reading an article. Don't judge me. But uh, <laughs> I was reading, Um, there was a, a salon hair care specialist. They were saying that and, and I, I recommend everybody try this. I'm trying it out right now. Um, they're the experts, so I, I I hear what they're saying. I give it a try, but I feel like everybody needs to sort of figure it out for themselves. But they said that shampoo is for your scalp. So they were saying you apply the shampoo to your hair, you know, you put a little bit on your fingers and you rub it into your scalp, not your hair. So I don't know, if you're like me, I tend to do one of these <laughs> when I'm shampooing. Like I take it from the bottom, yeah, and I put it all at the top and I kind of move it all around and I get like the full lather going. And then I think that's what was drying out my ends because this person was saying that shampoo um, 
it's better for like just your scalp. So you get it in your scalp and you shampoo your scalp. And then when you rinse it, it washes down to cleanse yeah. your hair. But by working up that lather, first of all, you're tangling your hair. And for those of us that are curly, this is probably not the most you should be having because it, it gets more tangled. But you by getting that lather and all that shampoo in your hair here, it strips it. So what I've been doing is I've been shampooing my hair with the chi shampoo and then, sorry, shampooing my scalp with the chi shampoo, rinsing it out and let it run down my hair. And then using either, usually the chi, I still have some advanced technique shampoos, either the chi shampoo or the advanced technique, sorry, conditioner to do like my hair hair. So then I, I wash my hair, I co-wash, I wash with the conditioner my hair itself. And I think that is also, I've been finding that after I wash, my hair isn't as dry as it used to be. So um, Sharina, Miss Alice, for those of you, for Milagros, like if, if you're finding that it's drying out your hair, you can just try to wash your scalp with the, the shampoo and then wash your hair itself with conditioner. Let's all try it, see how it goes, <laughs> see how it works out. I think Miss Milagros is a little bit frozen here. She'll be coming back to us soon, but um, that was a great tip that I found online. So um, shampoo your scalp, condition your hair. And then you can always add a mask. Oh, Milagos is coming back. We've lost her. I was, I was kicked out. <laughs> technology, technology. Sorry. It wasn't <laughs> no. But thank you so We're much. Rambling. Thank you so much. I love, I love, I think we're, we just had a good time today. Uh, thank you, Sharon. Yeah, well, we, got, we got a little sidetracked talking about other stuff, but. And Xiomara says that last year, uh, she, last year, uh, she went gray. I went gray last year. I love yeah. it. But using the Chi Silver uh, Nun Color for shine. Wow. Thank you for sharing that. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Here's some pictures so that we can see if you have a before and after. I would love to see this the non how the non color works. Yes, I'm planning to do that with my mom once I get get to see her. Um, I haven't seen my mom in a few months, so mail it to her. Well, she for YouTube live. <laughs> she'll never do it. She'll probably wait until I do it for her. <laughs> But thank you so much, everyone, for sharing. And, and uh, we're getting a lot more interaction here with um, our uh, Thursdays with Georgiana. And I love it. Thank you so much for tuning in and, and having a party with us because this is what it's all about. We want, we want to interact with you. We, had it, we want to chat with you and share ideas together. Um, and um, we're happy that we're bringing these chats for you every Thursday. So tune in for next Thursday at 11, at 11 a.m. Um, usually uh, we go live uh, around 11.20. So we always share the link and, um, and we look forward to, to seeing you. I call the number on the back of the box. Oh, nice. Yes, they do have. Thank you for sharing that, Xiomara, that they do have um, actual consultants, uh, hairstylists from Chi is not, it's not the Avon customer service. So the, the number in the back of the box, they will, um, they will, you know, tell you what color to use and, you know, you just describe what kind of color you have. And um, if you have problems with covering grains and, and how to do it, I actually got that idea I always so she called them. That's nice, and they, she said they're very nice. Um, I got that idea from a video training that 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 she's um, a specialist. She did, so that's why I decided to go to, with two colors this time. So, yeah. Oh, that's good that they have that. So that's another great tool that we could share with our customers. If you're not sure what to do, call this number. <laughs> yes, Speak to the expert. Yes, thank you so much. Um, we're yes, over our time, but I hope that that um, it was useful, everything that we shared. Thank you, Georgiana, for being so awesome. <laughs> thank you for joining us and sharing your amazing tips. We always appreciate your ideas and your feedback. It's, and everyone in the comments box, you mm -hmm. guys have been sharing a lot of great tips, which is awesome. Yes. Now we'll start to feel. <laughs> 
Like we're not alone. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you all. Thank you so much. I will see you. We'll see you guys, girls and ladies, next week. Bye. Bye, everyone. Love you. <laughs>